Hello everybody, my name is Miss Ray Ray and welcome back to part three of episode four of Life is Strange. So this should probably be our last part in this episode and then we can go and wait for episode five, which I'm so excited for. Okay, so we just left Frank's RV with the codes peacefully without anyone getting hurt after like the second try. I'm kind of proud of myself because I'm a fuck up at games. So let's leave with Chloe. I'm proud of myself. Back to the board. What was that? What is that? That's like one of those uh, plane thingies. Like, you know, when you go over the plane over a certain Holy, desert and there's all those like okay? weird writing, drawing things on there. But you can't I'm see it because when you're like right there because it's nice to have one less enemy in Arcadia Bay. Amen to that. I better focus on this board and start tying these clues together. Why do I have Frank's number? Hi Max, just thought I'd wish you and Chloe good luck for your search with that. With what little luck I have. Thanks, Frank. The bigger our team of work we have, I see why Chloe digs you. Stop by later if you both want to party and good luck. Aww. He likes me. Why do I have his name and number in my phone? I mean, just a little. Just, just a little creepy. Okay. Is there anything in here that I... Sparkle Horse? I'm totally playing Sparkle Horse. Ah, Forgot I turned off the music. That's sad. Hey Max, see I'm if you can sad. put together all those Rubik's clues. Just holla if you need any info while I go online to make sure we haven't missed anything. Oh, Hacker Chloe. Okay. Max, I know we can snap all these pieces together. Roger that. I'm gonna study the board and try to connect all these dots. Okay. Gather info on a character by selecting all the correct clues for each specific for each section. There's a Let's look at Frank's drug deals during the week of the party. Hmm. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna do this by computer. Because that looks easier. Or not. Fine then, bitch. I don't even know what that is. Could I have looked at it first? Rot Mustang okay. for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Rotten. Okay. So that's his client list. Or client code. Okay, so... Okay, come on. Investigate. Yes, investigate. I'm so glad you're with me on that. Dear God. I have to analyze Nathan's messages. Oh, that's what a fire. Okay. unlock this phone? Student file. Paper. No. SM card, maybe? Or SIM card? Why the hell? Could that little piece of paper do anything? I don't know what to do! Why are you being such a bitch? Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Coordinates? Map? Um... David really has been on Rachel's ass for a while. She should have been upset. I claim that David Maskell was following her. I'd taken photographs. David would deny this and give him. 
what company Rachel has been keeping. I'm not certain I can believe her right now. Oh, boo, boo you whore. Paper? Does David know what's going on with Rachel, or is he just paranoid about everybody? I have a feeling. Plate picture, Nathan picture, Matt. Okay, how this? This makes no sense, Max. <sighs> okay, well then, deselect that one. Hmm. Maybe he was trying to help Kate in his own messed up way. Wait, no, read that. Overheard Kate and Dana talking about supplies for dark security. Dr oh, that. I don't think those go to the coordinates. Maybe license plate photos? Looks like David was tracking somebody's car. Maybe even Nathan's. Good clue. Good, good. Uh, Frank's clues. <clears throat> that letter. There's no doubt she loved him in some way. Um, paper. Frank is for sure the local dealer, but I, I doubt Rachel was carrying drugs for him. David and Nathan right? have both come to my office to warn me about Rachel Alibrand's been a drug mule and Dr. Mass. Mr. Madsen's talk radio terminology acting as a front for another local dealer considering Rachel's exemplary status I told David I would need more concrete proof and he promised me he had more to show that's why he was following her okay account book we can select that with that paper yes okay. the game is on now, talk to us, account book. Tell us everything. <sighs> okay. Let's see if I can find any deal Frank made with Nathan or the Vortex Club. Well, oh, how about I look at it first? Frank sure is keeping his customers satisfied. He could open a store. I think he would need a bit more money. Okay, um... Boxer, Bulldog, do Nathan at 10 at Blackwell. Um, no, wait, does it like that? I need to read it first. Everybody in Australia Bay must be high. That explains a lot. Well, except you. I bet you're not on there. Uh, I do not see Rottweiler on there. So, come on. There you go. If Frank applied this kind of detail to his life, who am I to talk? Right, girly? I was about to say, stop judging. I... Chihuahua? Oh my god, no, who's Chihuahua? Who is Chihuahua? Okay, Max, remember these names and... <gasps> Katie. See how Nathan fits in with all this. It can't be our Katie. It can't be our Katie. I mean, yeah, if I could, I would, but. Okay, so I'm gonna say select this one because that's what that's what Nathan was on. Huh. Two deals with Nathan on the same day? Party supplies, no doubt. Uh, let's see, okay, so like that one there should be one more I'm getting a contact high just reading this I don't see Rottweiler on there that's the only that's the last one I have to check out I wonder what dog name Frank would have given me Beagle These are all the times and places for Frank and Nathan's deals. That's it, Max. Okay, yay, we figured it out. Wait a minute. I want to check, is Beagle on there already taken? Because I wanted to see. What? Oh, damn it, I missed it. 
Move. Move. Oh, thank. No. Oh, stop. Stop with the lag. Okay. did this. Just like that with the plates and a map. Damn. I, I must have missed something. Maybe that one? <sighs> no. This is not working. I'll have to analyze these plates and coordinates to see if Nathan was under David's surveillance. Oh, you you need to get rid of these damn cameras, David. Oh, these. Uh, okay. Uh, so then, deselect that. Maybe Nathan's pictures? And that's all she wrote. <sighs> Please let me find some clues about Nathan in here. I mean, it would seem like it. I still can't get over the fact that Nathan's fucking car, his license plate, is twilighting. I mean, dear God. Great. Now, how do I find out which car is Nathan's to match the coordinates? No, I mean, look first. That's stupid. definitely Chloe's car. Oh, hmm. I mean, look, dear God, why maybe can't I, I should have let Warren beat Nathan's ass down just this once. Hmm, who does this car belong to? Six Fittender? Ah, either that says Six Fittender or Sex Finder, either way. Okay. Why are there so many red trucks Interesting. in here? Interesting. Is this Nathan's car? Okay, no, I'm sorry. I thought it said Twilight and. It does look like it. Can I? S of course, Nathan drives an SUV. Oh, Overcompensating. No. Hey, look. As usual. They both have um that one and that one. Both have um what you call it? The thing. I want to look at this picture, though, because that is of me and Chloe, I believe. There's Nathan nope. dealing to the kids That's right Nathan. out in the open. That's at the school. Huh. Who else was David tracking here? TPF... Okay, no, I mean... What was... That one. S X F T N D R. This one. Okay. I'm not reading all those latitudes and longitudes. Oh, yes. Now we're finally getting somewhere. Chloe, let's plug in these numbers and see if they lead to an actual address. Aye, aye, Captain. Here we come, Rachel. Can I do... There was another part in there, right? Yeah, there was one, and I did that one. Now I have to look at this. I think there was one more that I was missing. The Frank one? No. That David and Nathan is last. Okay, I, that's all I have left. Couldn't hurt to give this pin code a whack. Wait, no, what did it say? One, 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 one. Or the eight, seven, eight, nine, seven, eight, oh, eight, maybe? 
<laughs> I'm so good. Okay. Select. Select. What is this? Holy shit. Nathan is seriously unhinged. But those numbers might be useful. Okay, he has 9535 circled. And judging by the way he writes, he is constantly angry, seeking approval, and off of his meds. Oh, there has got to be some good shit in his phone. I just need the code to unlock it. Okay, you have a SIM card right there, a piece of paper right there with numbers on it, and what the fuck else could I select? If there is a dark room, we better find it. I don't even think Good thing Chloe anything. slipped all these files on her flash drive. Flat. Let's look at the damn flyer. This is the Vortex Club party where Nathan drugged Kate. Okay. Did he do the same thing to Rachel at another party? Yes, he did. Oh, so busted. It's good to see the Prescotts can't cover up all their tracks. Let me read it then. Mr. and Mrs. Fr we regret to inform you that Nathan Prescott has disrupted various classes over the past month, despite repeated warnings and leniency. Due to a crude outburst in Mrs. Hyoda's class, Intro to Literature, class on Tuesday, September 20th, Nathan, Nathan was sent back to his dormitory for the day without a proper write-up for his files. Nathan has enormous potential but also erratic behavior patterns that may need supervision beyond Blackwell's ability. The school cannot tolerate these disruptions, so we hope you will discuss this matter with Nathan to impress upon him the severity of his situation. Please see the attached files for full report. Where's the attached files? Oh, I need four for him. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna say dark room. This makes no sense, Max. Well, then, goddamn, fine. Better look for any clues or numbers that could be his pen code. That one is selected, bitch. That one. Oh, you're treading water, Otter. Try again. Looks like this isn't the right combination. I wonder if there's any important dates or numbers in the school file. Okay, wait, no. What do I have selected? I have the phone, that, paper, flyer. Do you select the flyer? Flyer. Okay, Max. Let's blow this code up and go home. I have to. Nee. God damn it. This can't fucking fight. You fuck up my dorm, dorm door, I'll kill your scholarship. Love you too, Nathan. Besties. Let's start hacking. Uh, you... I don't see a. F other than it saying 1995 on there. Oh, wait, no, shit, go back. What was this one? 9535. Okay. 9535. Oops. Bad code. Was it one, 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 one? Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. God damn. I might have to rewind this. Okay, well, let me see. 0058 3988 5536 5431. Why is 542? 
I'm gonna try zero zero five eight. Zero zero five eight. You locked it, dumbass. Ninety-five. <sighs> yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Oh my god, this is gonna take forever, and I am running out of space on my tissue paper. Um, uh, Fort Lauderdale, Parrot, Prescotts. Um. Did that say zero one nine eight zero one nine eight? You locked it, dumbass. Hey. Five. Is that a five or a six? How? What do a sixes look like? That's what a six is looking for, so that's a five. Five, five, three, six. You locked it, dumbass. <coughs> Bless me. Okay, okay. Eight. Oops, bad code. Maybe it's O eight two nine because August twenty ninth, O eight two. Nine? <gasps> I did it! I did it! Yay! Yay! It's up made the G. Okay, cool. Bitch, you sold me water, asshole. Calm down, bring it to me, bringing it. Stay away, pigs on the beach. Yes. Uh, this is all about Nathan trying to score for the Vortex Club party. <sighs> Nathan was jonesing hard the night of the party. He didn't have enough drugs. Only cash calls. You have a car and a time. Charge me double. Damn right. Have cash on you. No fucking around. Give me the address. I'll call to give you the exact directions. In transit. Get that money Drug out. Drug dealer drama. Almost three in the morning. It'll, yeah, you ask if someone's up. Peruvian flakes. Skidoo acid. Paying night prices, don't make me wait. Sorry for being a dick, need more stuff, you home. Yes, don't come. Fuck off. Well, I mean, at least he's nice to his supplier. God, Nathan. You're out of control. So it was you. Now I can officially call you a psycho stalker. Is this from Nathan's father? That's brutal. Before being high is no excuse anymore. This business not just a hobby. You want me to treat like an adult who can get things done on his own, impress me, and like nothing more than to be proud of you. I'm not there yet. How rude!
Take a breath, Max. Yes, Both take a breath, dear God. I can find out where Nathan took my eye after hurts. the party. Do oh, soon. What? What? What are these? Oh, can you select? Because I want to know what this is. Bitch, you sold me water, asshole. Calm down, bring it to me, bringing it. Stay away, kids on the beach. So, this infamous party was the fourth. That beach is like Frank's main office. Oh, dates and times, okay. Uh, and you look for the fourth. Nathan at the junkyard? I mean, that's the third. I know Nathan wasn't <sighs> looking for Bigfoot in the forest. The first and the fifth. Somebody is stocking up on gas. Why? Especially at that price. Wait, no, that said fourth. That said fourth. That said fourth. Okay. Select this one. Um. Ooh, that one says fourth at eleven. That's not the right time, though. Seventh. Makes me wonder, though. We are completely looking at Nathan. But what if he's kind of just a red herring? I mean, okay, come on. Four. Okay, I think I want this one. Maybe. I need to find one of these. Oh, you're treading no. water, Otter. Try don't, again. Don't ever say that. I can't. Okay, there you go. These are the seventh. Go back. God. Seventh. These are from the fourth. Okay. If I can match one of the text messages and transactions with Frank, then I can find the exact location. Wait a minute. So, wait a minute. Look at that again. Read. Oh, get in transit. Get that money out. Okay, so... They probably that the last one was at ten thirty four, so the and it's probably gonna be around eleven. That's a six, not a okay, so deselect that one. Look at this. No doubt that Nathan stays in his dorm room. So he could be hiding clues there too. We already looked there, sweetie. Um four o'clock, four o'clock, four no. Fork? No. No. If Not Joyce knew what Nathan did to Chloe, she would fry his ass. I'd have oh, a lot better things to do to be the price kind of state. Poor rich Nathan. Okay. Not much else here. Mm, that that's a six, never mind. What? That's a weird ass looking barn. Four seven at night. 
five, thirty, and seven. May okay. This has to be one. Max, there is no logical link between those clues. And then deselect that. Maybe. Uh look at this one. It needs to be on okay. Select that one. This makes no sense, Max. Those two make sense because the texts were at two thir ten thirty. The transaction was at eleven. I just need to find one of the pictures that go with Since Kate left the party early with Nathan. I should search for texts, locations, and transactions in the evening. Thank you for that. I had no idea. Okay. So that says 10-4 at like 5.30. Looks like this is not relevant at all. Max, I hate you. Okay. What is this? I thought that said six. I cannot believe Holy that was a four. I cannot this read this boy's handwriting. This is definitely the place. <laughs> Let me dig up some more clues here. Yeah, okay. Nope. Nothing, Max. There's nothing here. Just a shitty old barn. Let's keep searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. I'm on this. Hold on. Give you three guesses. Somebody named Harry Aaron... Prescott. I'm shocked. Should we call the police? Fuck that. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed up. As you've noticed, this whole town is messed up. <clears throat> we can't trust anybody except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. I was afraid you'd say that. We could call Warren since he kicked Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us, nobody else. And I'm not scared at all. You have the power. I feel like we're this close to finding Rachel. We have to find her, Max. We will. But remember, my power isn't infinite. We still have to be careful. I wonder if she's going to keep her powers after Do all of this. Hear, Chloe? You should probably yes, exit sir. that out just in case some snoops go looking around. I mean, your mom's probably at work. Just saying. But, you know, who am I? I'm just a gamer girl sitting at a desk drinking coffee. I make no common sense. Here. Are you kidding? My barn works looks, looks worse than that. Whoa, check this out. Fresh tire tracks. Dude, somebody was just here. Oh, look at that. We need to get in that barn. Okay, sorry. Thought my mic was going wonky again. Hmm. They're way over here. Hey, look, a metal sheet. Chloe, I found the front door. <laughs> Come on. <coughs> <coughs> Dear God. Oh, yes. Maximus rules. This is way too Blair Witch. I have goosebumps all over. Really, Blair Come Witch. On, Max. Hey, check out this old chest. A little louder, Chloe. Who is Jeez, around to hear you? Is that a door? Egypt. Jackpot. Old shit. No. Look just... closer. Harry, Aaron, Prescott, and family donate new library to Arcadia Bay. Prescott Industries celebrate grand opening. The Prescotts bring bomb shelter boom to town. Nice scrapbook. 
You search for more clues and I'll scope out the area. And move. There you go. Lion! Okay. Thanks for pulling up Nathan. Talking about going ape. You deserve to beat down, but I don't want to stoop to his level. Besides, somebody is going to kick his ass sooner or later. You're wise, Grasshopper. Thanks, but I wasn't exactly the hero this town needs. You still paid your heroes due. Or your hero dues. Now we just need costumes. Speaking of, I hope you're coming to party tonight so we can celebrate. I'll let you know, promise. Cool. Now I have to calm myself down. Thanks for leaving your mark on my door. I'll never. Ah. Uh... Ah, oh, they're totally gonna bang later in the future. Yes, old Prescott clippings. But that can't be the only thing here. Hey, look, a tractor. This tractor has paid its dues. It's still got a few years in it. Mine looks older than that. Mine's older than my mom. What is that rumbling? Ah, the good old days. Oh, right. Hmm. Back when you could buy groceries for three dollars. So many haystacks, so few needles. Mm. A haystack can be a needle if you think about it. <sighs> These hooks are used to lift haystacks. I saw them in a Friday the 13th movie. What is that rumbling? Just rotting wood. Mm -hmm. If a zombie shows up, I have my weapon. That is a horrible weapon for a zombie apocalypse. Ground. Why does it want me to switch the ground <sighs> so much? Here. You better put that hay back, girly, or people are gonna know you're there. Over there already. Apparently, this is still good ground. Stop that. Damn, lots of info here. My controller vibrates whenever I'm walking somewhere. It bugs me. Stop moving the table. Whoa. What is this? It's totally brand new. No, Supermax. You can't open this with your bare hands. I understand that, but you told me to look at it. Okay, Chloe. Um, I, I found some kind of hatch, but it's locked. I got this. I hope. Let me know the second you need any help. Oh. I like the platform. Can I go up it? I should go upstairs and get Chloe to help me. Chloe! Can you give me a hand? Sidekick at your service. I'm such a dork. <laughs> Pop up and away, Supermax. I dig having you in this. Hmm. Okay. Can I climb up this one? <gasps> Holy shit. Almost killed you, but okay. What is that? Wait a minute! No, look down. Look, d make me move the camera. What is that anyway? Like I want to know. It's weird looking for a tractor. I hear a truck. Is that why my thing keeps rumbling? Here's the other end of the rope. Huzzah! Rope! Okay. Hey, 
Okay, look. Rope. Look at it. For goddamn Max. Hey, Chloe. Can you attach the hook to that padlock? Oh, you are clever. I am all over this. I will be done. Then you better step away from that hatch. Oh. Damn. Do not fall. <laughs> okay. I was supposed to go way beyond that. That thing wasn't supposed to fall. It's a motor. It's a weird looking motor. Tell me if you need any help. Hey, Chloe, can you attach the hook to that padlock? Oh, you are clever. I am all over this. Oh, I like her shoes. I will be done. Then you better step away from that hatch. How about you are on this side so you don't get caught in the rope? Get away from the rope. Really? MacGyver strikes again. Don't tell me what to do. Hey, Club Club. I already know that there's a platform there. How about we go through this hatch? You're after Nathan, not Sean. Damn. I mean, they're both big bags, but. Is this Jackpot? Do I even need to say how weird this is? He is dead. Who built this kind of place? A Prescott, of course. You're not even in it yet. I mean, yeah, you need to go in it. I'm not one. This is not. This is absolutely something you should judge. But where are they getting their power from? I mean, this is an old-ass barn. Does it have its own generator? This bunker is so surreal. Damn it. First a padlock, then a digicode? Someone really doesn't want visitors. Uh, oh, hey, look. The two, four, and four. Five, four, two. Okay, I remember. It was the red one on Nathan's, um, what you call it. Okay. I am a genius! I am a beautiful genius. I didn't even really think that one was important. God. I have the weirdest memory. Like, seriously, I'll, for I'll forget that I fed my grandma. Like and ready that day, apocalypse. but I'll remember something like I'll remember what I had for lunch like five years ago. Come on. This looks like a surgery room. Not a hospital I want to go into. What the fuck is that? What the hell is this? What was no? What was that? What just went up and down and floofed out of here? Whoa. This says it all about me. He needs help. You think? Okay. Dear Mr. Chris, Scott, <laughs> as Nathan's primary psychiatrist for five years, I feel I should stop. S I feel I should stop seeing your son, as you have disregarded my rather dire and immediate suggestions for the for his and others 
well-being. You know well the extent of Nathan's challenges, but I feel that you refuse to acknowledge the role you play in his mental health. If you do not, ha if I do not have your support, I cannot treat Nathan. It is as simple as that. I fear he is becoming even more disconnected from reality, even if he acts in a personable manner. You have ignored my requests for a consultation with you and your wife, so I have to assume that you are no longer interested in my services. Regardless, I care about Nathan, and I believe he needs serious help. If you would like to talk about this matter, I am always available. Best, Dr. Jigaby. <sighs> okay. Everything is sketchy as fuck. Nothing about Rachel here. You think I remember this. This is like a... Oh! It said the Prescotts hit the... What you call it? Um... Bomb town boom. This is probably Don't one of the bomb shelters. It's always a path sign. I mean, not unless you're underwater, then the bunker would need duct tape to get make the water stay out. A f rather large photo printer. I guess he <clears throat> needs the most expensive printer in the world. Really? Does he have? I bet he has a 3D printer. That would be creepy considering this game. Imagine chilling in this room. Oh, that son of a bitch. Drum oh, fucking shit. A million dollar stormbreaker bunker. Okay. So who's using this fancy tripod? I'd give you a guess, but you wouldn't guess. Uh, man, this is like legit though. I wish I had this set up. I wish a lot of people had this set up. Or I bet a lot of people wish they had this set up. Okay, bottle. Somebody Oops. likes their whiskey. I do, I do. These newspapers are all about Rachel and Tate. You're looking in here, and you're looking in there. Of course. Ah, the Apocalypse Entertainment System. <laughs> Let's check that cupboard. That one looks foreboding. There's a lot more photos in here than I originally thought. Come on, let's see what this shit is all about. We are. Who's Victoria? Okay. A binder marked Victoria, but Ooh. it's empty. Look, the next one says Kate. <sighs> no, Kate. No. God, I should have killed that bastard back there. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. <sighs> Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. These can't be real. These are all... These are all post shots, right? Right? Chloe, look at her face. She's... out of it. Maybe... Maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think so. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Then, then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead. No way. She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it. Please, let's go. Oh. Oh my God. I don't. I don't. Rachel. Remember. Kate. All these vibes. Run, bitch. God, this you have place to run. Actually, feels evil. It is. I swear this is a horror movie.
Okay. I know this is a cliffhanger, but I'm getting on 50 minutes here and I can't have this go over an hour or else this shit goes crazy. I have to leave this here. Part 4 will be very short and I'm playing it right after this, I promise. Ugh, but I have to leave this here. So thank you so much for watching. And I promise I'll have part 4 up immediately after I put this up. So stay tuned and I will see you guys in the next video. Have a wonderful life.